Thank you, thank you so much, thank you. Thank you so much, thank you. Thank you, thank you very much. Well, we're back, and what you're gonna learn here today is how to add the oil filter to your R90 Racer. Classic super bike, classic race bike. It's showtime. <laughs> going to work on the oil and oil filter um, this is very important removing oil is a messy thing so when that oil comes out it's going to want to splash all over the floor and spill so we have a technique for dealing with that we're going to lay a plastic film over this beautiful carpet to protect it and to stop splashes of oil going on the carpet so let's do that now. What we've got here is the plastic film called Final Solution and we have our oil derrick. So also wear gloves because this stuff is messy and have kitchen paper on standby. Okay, here comes the replacement oil filter. And so on the R19 racer, we treated her to a K&M. Good filters, never have any issues with them. They're pretty good. Something we need to talk about. Now, on YouTube, there's been a lot of negativity about k and oil filters on this nut here, where the welds break, where those little dots are and that these give way and then oil is able to find its way out and seep through this piece here and oil leaks out of the filter the mistake that everybody makes is look at the packaging it says to ratchet off the filter okay and then put this here so that when it comes to changing the oil filter you can ratchet it off and take the oil filter off because what happens is when these oil filters get really really hot cool down get really really hot cool down is they set and they get rock hard so when it comes to undoing an oil filter it can be a right little bugger and really difficult that's why K&M put this nut here so that it makes your life a lot easier to just ratchet off the oil filter when it's very very tight but this is not for talking this is not for tightening the oil filter it's for taking it off so that's the mistake everybody makes and when people talk the oil filter on the nut that's what weakens these seams here these these welds and then oil from then this can fail because everybody forgets look at the packaging it says to ratchet it off, not the nut, to ratchet the oil filter off, not to tighten it up. Also, a really nice touch by K&M is that they actually pre-lubricate the oil seal, which is really good. So that means that you, if this was any other oil filter, what you'd do is take some old engine oil lubricate the uh, the seal but no k and n have actually pre-done that for you to make not only your life easier which is great it's a very practical head thing to do um it means you can just crack on with fitting this oil filter whoa, 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 whoa. okay so you just put the packaging off Usually just rip it off. Oh, there you go. Okay. Bring your packaging away. With the, um, see how the oil filter is pre lubricated? So, what you're going to do is actually you're going to attach this by hand first. Um, what you can do is just work down the surface in here. 
and something on blue rag or kitchen paper and you just you're just wiping down the uh, the surface as best that you can that's all you're doing I uh, see the muck that's coming off and that's just by wiping the mating surface a couple of times now and it's just That's not easy to film. Okay, you're just going to be as careful as you can. There is not a lot of space to work with. And you're just going to first install the filter by hand. Why are you installing it by hand? So that as you fit it, you're not, um, you get more feel with your hands if you feel that the uh, filter is going to try and cross thread you can do something about it then rather than just using a tool going all gun ho and then cross threading the filter and going oh no it's too late now now you're going to need a tool to help finish tightening up the filter. That is the oil filter installed. Get the oil filter as hand tight as possible and use um, 11 Newton meters. BMW specify 11 Newton meters on this one. And the oil filter is torqued down and happy. Adding the oil filter, a lot easier, um, and it really helps that we use the k &M Performance Oil Filter. So, um, being able to tighten it up by hand as best as possible, then finishing off. Um, the little rascal has spirit. That's awesome. This is the end of the trail for me. Thank you. Uh, thank you, kid.